All right, you guys. So this reading will be for my Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. All right, Pisces. We're going to see what's going on with you guys the end of January. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. All right, Pisces. Let's dive in deep and let's see what's going on with you guys. What's going on for my Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. All right, Pisces. Let's, let's see. What's going on with my Pisces? Pisces, the end of January. What's going on for my Pisces? All right, Pisces. All right, we got here the Nine of Wands. So you could be dealing with a Sagittarius, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius with this Nine of Wands. All right, so tell me more about this Nine of Wands energy. Oh, so we got here the Three of Swords. Okay, Pisces. So, you know what I'm showing, Pisces? You're almost about to break. Okay? You're almost about to break break here. More of, you know, I'm showing that something is heartbreaking or something is breaking your heart here. But it's like, Pisces, you're not letting anyone know that, you know, something is heartbreaking to you. All right? But it's just like, you're so close to ball it out in tears. Like, that's what I'm showing here. Like, it, it's showing that, you know, it's just like you can't keep up this happy face for long. All right, Pisces? Whatever that's going on in the, in, at the end of January, that's what I'm showing, y'all. Okay. Okay. Watch out for the number 93 or 39, 933 or 399, Pisces. I'm also showing that, Pisces, you could be dealing with a Libra, an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. Doesn't have to be, but y'all, this is what I'm seeing, all right? So tell me more about this Nine of Wands and this Three of Swords for Pisces. All right, Pisces. So we got here judgment. So this could be about a Scorpio. Watch out for the letter J, okay? The letter T, the letter S. That's what I'm showing you guys. So we got here the judgment. Watch out for the number 20, okay? So I'm showing that you're looking at someone differently because of this. All right, so let's clarify. Come on now. Tell me more about this Three of Swords. Because that's what I'm showing, Pisces. You in this energy the end of this month. So what I'm showing, Pisces, it's because all about a communication that was had that's coming. That's what I'm showing, Pisces. This all boils down to some sort of communication. And like I said, you could be dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But this is why all this is happening is because of the Queen of Swords, y'all. So I'm showing that there's some communication that's coming in, Pisces. So we're going we're gonna to see what this Queen of Swords is. Tell me more about this Queen of Swords. And we got here the magician. So this, this talks about this person was waiting. They was waiting to speak their mind. They was waiting to communicate with you. They was waiting to tell you this, Pisces. You cannot make this shit up. Look, Pisces, look. I don't need you on any other else, baby. We got here the magician. So this talks about that this person that you're dealing with, they were just like, oh, yeah, I need to talk to Pisces. Oh, yeah, I need to tell Pisces this. Oh, I need to run my mouth to Pisces. And what I'm showing, Pisces, whatever this is, is bringing in this Three of Swords energy, all right? But this is this is the thing, Pisces. You, It's just like you got this, this face up as in, you know, something's not bothering you. It's not stressing you. It's not worrying you. But I'm showing that it is, okay? 
Tell me more about this judgment. Tell me more about the judgment for Pisces. We got here the lovers. So this is somebody you're dealing with, someone you was dating, all right, or are dating. Watch out for the letter the letter L, okay? I'm showing the letter S again, the letter M, all right? I'm showing Gemini energy here as well. This is from somebody, you, you shared a strong connection with this person. Like, I'm showing that you and this person, Pisces, y'all was tight. Y'all was so tight. Yeah, it's like y'all, you two was so close. All right. And it, it felt like nothing could go wrong until now. So tell me more about this Queen of Swords. Like I said, it all boils down to the Queen of Swords. It all boils down to this communication. Mm -mm. And this is the thing, Pisces. This Queen of Swords could be any sign, okay? It doesn't have to be an air sign. This could be any sign that you're dealing with, okay, y'all? We got here the Queen of Pentacles. So this could be involving your money, your stability as well, all right? Because they're telling you about someone else, all right? And it could be an earth sign that you're dealing with. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, okay, Pisces? All right, Pisces. We got here the Hermit. So definitely a Virgo. There's a Virgo around you, okay? Then I tell you a lot of Earth here towards Virgo Capricorn energy. We got here the Hermit. All right, you guys. So isolation, being alone. All right, and we got here the Three of Cups. All right, so you hear, you hear. It's like you hear something through a third-party energy, a third-party connection about this person that you're dealing with. We got two threes here, so watch out for the number six. Watch out for the number nine, okay? Like I said, 39, Okay, you guys, watch out for the letter Q. They call this person Q. They call this person D. <laughs> We got here the four of wands. So it's just like you come together with together with this third party. You know this third party. This third party could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This also talks about a union. You coming together. Okay. Watch out for the number 34 or 43. All right. So it's just like some sort of communication that's coming in. And it could be like frightening, like devastating. Okay, you guys, to the point where you're just like, okay, this, you know, this is hurting my feelings. This is breaking my heart a little bit that you told me this, all right? And I'm showing, like, it, it could be from a third-party influence, a third-party connection that's, you know, telling you this, all right, you guys? Somebody is not coming in to talk to you, but this third party is telling you what's going on, all right? And I'm sure, like, there could be also an invite out, Pisces, all right, from this third party, and then you could be hearing about this, about what's going on, okay, moving forward, all right, you guys? All right, Pisces, this is the only thing I have for you. Please like, subscribe, and share. Thank you.